Right, I'll have you know. I'll have you know. The, well, the three, well, the two reviews so far, uh, along with this one, were made in the same day. So, yeah. And again, it's only like four minutes, so I may even like make this into just a compilation. So, like, if I can do that. Again, I don't know how to edit videos, so that will probably never happen. Anyways, today I'm reviewing the 6-inch Gigan figure. Hold up. I gotta go get a tag. Because I've kept a tag. Whatever it is. But I kept it. That's what I wanted to do. And now I don't know where it is. But probably not. Um. Sorry, I'm back. I was looking for the tag. You may have heard me. I'm not sure if you could or not. Possible. Was this is Bandai? I think Bandai Japan. Six inch guy again. And let's see here. Let's. Yeah, 1998 is when this was made. Not exactly a good year for Godzilla. So, really nice detail. I love it. It's one of my, ever since I like, really since I started watching a little bit more of like, character, like character videos, or like videos with Gigan in them, I've kind of started to in, be, be more, um, like Godzilla, or like Gigan more than I do Godzilla. Because I feel like Godzilla, don't get me wrong, he is still one of the favorites, but like everybody always... Picks Godzilla over the others. I personally would pick some of the others over Godzilla. Yeah, because I'm not saying I don't like Godzilla, but I feel Gigan is, you know, like Godzilla. You know everything about. If you're a Godzilla fan, you probably know more about Godzilla than you do any other monster. But then there's fans like me who kind of don't really exactly think that much of the main character. As much as they do the other characters. Gigan being one of my favorites now. And this is actually the, the third ever Gigan figure I've ever had. The other two I lost, so don't ask about those. Pretty good sculpt. Pretty, definitely a good paint job. I thought that this right here could move, but it can't. I mean, unless you want to break it, but still. And this is supposed to be a buzzsaw. On this one, it just kind of looks like claw, like just like little spikes on his chest and stomach. But actually, I, I would rate this a ten out of ten. I rate I rated all the ones I've reviewed so far that. And uh, well, honestly, I'm kind of impressed. Anyways, that was the Bandai Japan. Yeah. Mm, Bandai Japan. Uh, Gigan six inch figure classical edition or show edition. And this is the first one they made, because the other one was more of a bluish tint, which I think is what it shows up on the camera, or a dark green. The, 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 there's another variant of it that was dark blue. Anyways, be good folks. Don't annoy your parents. And if this comes out during Thanksgiving, don't ask for anything until Christmas. Be honorable.